Have you ever wondered why sometimes Border Gateway Protocol or BGP neighbors just refuse to establish a connection? It's a common issue that can stump even the most seasoned network engineers. Today we'll delve into the world of BGP, demystify some of its complexities, and provide a step-by-step -step guide to troubleshoot BGP neighbor establishment issues. Let's start at the beginning. Picture this scenario. You've configured your BGP, yet the neighborship is not coming up. It's quite the predicament, isn't it? The first step is to check the basics. Are the routers reachable? Try pinging the neighbor's IP address. No response? There might be an issue with the physical connection or IP connectivity. But what if the pings are successful? Well, that's when we move on to step two. Check the BGP configuration. Ensure the autonomous system or AS numbers match on both ends of the connection. Remember, BGP uses AS numbers to identify networks. If there's a mismatch, the neighborship will fail. Moving on to step three, verify the BGP versions. Are both routers using the same BGP version? If not, they won't be able to establish a connection. Make sure they're on the same page. What if all these checks come out clean? Then we delve deeper. Step four involves checking the BGP timers. These timers, namely the hold time and keep alive time, need to match on both routers. If they don't, the BGP session won't stay up. Still no luck? Don't lose heart. Step five is to check the BGP network statements. These statements tell BGP which networks to advertise. If the network is not in the BGP table, the neighborship will not come up. Step six, the final step is to check the access control lists or ACLs. ACLs can block BGP traffic preventing the neighborship from establishing. Ensure there are no ACLs blocking traffic between the routers. So there you have it, a six step process to troubleshoot BGP neighbor establishment issues. To recap, First, check IP connectivity. Second, verify the AS numbers. Third, ensure the BGP versions match. Fourth, check the BGP timers. Fifth, verify the BGP network statements. And finally, ensure no ACLs are blocking BGP traffic. Remember, patience and persistence are key when troubleshooting network issues. By understanding and implementing these steps, you'll be well on your way to mastering the art of BGP troubleshooting, ensuring a smooth and efficient network operation. So the next time your BGP neighbor refuses to connect, you'll know exactly what to do. Happy troubleshooting!